that of academic English. And here, perhaps the two best known exams are those of the TOEFL and the IELTS. The TOEFL, the acronym stands for the Test of English as a Foreign Language. And some of the main features of this particular examination is that it's used by universities, uh, particularly in the US, to check that students from a different country have a high enough level of English to enter into a normal US academic program. It's not only used in the US, in fact, this particular exam is recognized through over 90 countries worldwide. And you don't get a particular grade with this type of examination. What they do is they test all the skills and you then get a cumulative score. There are two ways in which the examination can be taken. Either in a centre where you do a paper exam, so your multiple choice type questions are on paper, or it can also be done via computer. The tests actually cover the same things, be it on paper or the computer version. It's just a different method of marking. The second major academic English exam is that of the IELTS. And IELTS itself stands for the International English Language Testing System. It's a very similar exam to that of the TOEFL. In other words, it covers all skills. And again, it's used by universities, so it's recognised by universities as an entry-level exam. And one particular thing about this particular exam is that for both the reading and writing skills, you get to choose which type of examination that you take. So within the reading and writing examinations, you can choose to do either an academic exam or a more general option.